Truck is XTV on air. We are now live in three, two, one. Welcome back to the next episode of Persona 5 in the previous episode. As it's the last few days of summer vacation, can we not sleep? Thank you. As it's a few last days of summer vacation, next thing is we're going back to school and we're going to see Igor on what's up with him. Is he going to be saying the same stuff over and over? We'll figure it out about our rehabilitation. If you're like, if you're happy with this episode, make sure that like button is great. Appreciate the channel as we're going to get to a cutscene. Listen up, inmate. Our master wants a word with you. <laughs> it seems you formed a contract with another new ally. This is the owner of quite a different type of power. It will help guide you all to further heights as thieves. <laughs> Worry not. You are steadily approaching the realization of your goal. This is not necessarily to prove so, but I shall increase the number of personas you can hold at once. From here on, your tale will make great progress. Own your powers even further, and prepare for the time that will soon come. I expect great things from you. All right. Until we meet again. It is time, inmate. Ooh, a uniform. Make sure you study hard. <laughs> Futaba says she's going to shift to living a morning person's life. A healthy mission starts with a healthy lifestyle. Mission? And on to breaking news. In regard to the so-called Phantom Thieves events that have been a hot topic among the general public, the Prime Minister held a press conference at his official residence to address the problem. The government acknowledges the current rumors of the group called the Phantom Thieves. We are currently confirming facts with the police and wish to deal with it in an appropriate... Even the Prime Minister's talking about the Phantom Thieves? They're allies of justice, after all. They changed hearts, huh? I wonder if it's true. Hmm. Looks like we're finally being recognized across the country. Even though you have ambitions, you remain cool, hmm? I bet you stole that from me. Let's find clues on that case as soon as we can, too. And resolve it ourselves. For Futaba's sake, too. You two really get along, don't you? You're gonna be late if you don't get going soon. Good luck on your student duties! Second term's already started. 
I think this every year, but isn't summer vacation too short? It's like it always ends right when you get used to a life without school. Then again, I guess we had some fun things this year. <clears throat> All right, let's begin homeroom. Let's see, we've just gotten back from vacation, but starting next Monday is the school trip. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, you students are so lucky. You get an entire month off for summer and get to go to Hawaii too. Make sure that none of you cut loose too much, okay? Okay, settle down. That concludes homeroom. trip, huh? I guess we won't be able to act as phantom fi- <laughs> Takamaki-san! You can speak English, right? Basically, yeah. That's amazing. I lived over there, so it's nothing that special. Hey, if there's something we're not sure of in English, can we ask you about it? Huh? All people's talking about in my class is the Phantom Thieves. Is it the same for you? Talk about being popular. Anyways, now that a new semester started, let's have another operation meeting. Hey, student guidance offense. Why? Hey. Sensei. Sorry. Sorry to pull you out of class, but it's about Takase Guardians. <clears throat> I told them that I'm not going to pay them any more money. Hey, I'm quitting my part-time job too. <clears throat> Though I'm still in talks about, with my boss about it. I'm going to devote myself to being a great teacher no matter what others say. I won't waver. <clears throat> Excuse me. So thank you for giving me such good advice. I just thought you should be the first to know. Ms. Kamakami, you have a guest. The Takases are here. Great! It's time for them to sue. How long are you gonna make us wait? I think it's time for them to have a change of heart. Him again? You know it, lady. How rude. I guess a student is only as good as his teacher. Obviously, you lack a proper education. You thought you could just call and say you're not going to pay anymore? Who do you think you are? You know. It's what I decided for Takasakun's sake. I'm going to make sure there won't be any more students like him who... So you're just trying to get out of your responsibility. I bet you don't even care about Taiki. How are you still a teacher? Maybe we really should sue the Board of Education. Are you okay with that? A teacher who caused her student to die would surely cause a scandal. I'm not going to run or hide. I'm going to spend my time taking care of my students. If you want to take legal action, then go ahead. Regardless, I'll continue teaching. I decided that that's the best apology I can make to Takase-kun. Paying money to you two is not the solution, to say the least. Along with suing you, maybe I should tell everyone about your little secret. You know, about your little stint as a sex worker? What? How did you... Oh, so am I right? What? I mean, the amount of money you're paying us can't come from just a teacher's salary. Well, shall we head over on over to the faculty office? Stop, please. Ha, huh, a teacher working in the sex industry. You've definitely done it this time. How unfortunate for you, just you thought you could just leave. Taiki's matter unsettled. You know what you have to do now, right? Pay up and don't ever call us again with the garbage about stopping the payments. Yeah, we're definitely going to my mentors for this. <sighs> I guess I can't quit my part-time job just yet. You can't, you can't give up. Yeah, we're definitely going to my mentors for this. We're definitely going to my mentors. What about the Pen of Thieves? Would they even help someone like me? Yeah, we are. I need to do something. Or Sensei! The Takase's? The husband is Toshio-san and his wife is Hiromi-san. I could never forget them. I send them money every week. Wait, why? You don't intend on doing something, do you? Please don't. A Shujin sitting asking the Pen of Thieves for help would be... I'm sorry. I was so excited to tell you what I had decided and then it ended up like this. Just forget everything, okay? If you think about it, I'm right back where I started. 
It is time. I guess I'll never be able to change. It is time. <sighs> it is time. It is time. Why am I so excited for this? Yo, we got like three requests we have to do. Jesus Christ. It is time. Fast forward this. Time to save Sensei's hide. But which one's which? Because you never know which one we'll be taking it on. At the hideout. There you guys are. Futaba! Did you come here by yourself? I went to get her since I got out of school early. What a patronizing Inari. Well then, let's get talking. What do we do now? Should we go after another big target? That's important too, but what about that villain in the cognitive world? It's almost certain that this person exists. What's more, they're inducing mental shutdowns. We certainly can't turn a blind eye. <sighs> yeah, but we don't got any clues. But, you know how we're Toad's popular right now? Everyone at school's talking about us, and not a day goes by when you don't hear about it on TV either. We totally made it big, don't you think? True. The rankings on the Phantom Aficionado website have been crazy too. You mean this? Huh? What the hell? First place keeps changing by the second. People are voting around the clock after all. If we go after these guys, I'm sure we'll score some big cash at least once. What would you use money like that for? I've never heard of a phantom thief that saves up money. Are you fine with that, Futaba? Even though it's related to what happened to your mother? It's not okay. I'm definitely gonna punch that guy. The culprit forcing mental shutdowns. If you think about it, there's no bigger target than that. If we can change his heart and get a confession out of him, we'll be on top of the world for real. Should we reveal our identities then? Oh, I bet chicks are gonna be all over us. Whoa, whoa. You want us to show our faces? I guess that might be okay. I see. If the true culprit confesses the existence of the Metaverse will become known, there would be no need for us to remain in hiding in such a questionable manner. Hey, we're not doing this to stand out, you know. Being unknown is the allure of being a phantom thief. But considering the hype now, it's gonna be one hell of a huge deal if we pull it off. Are there really no clues regarding those mental shutdown cases? If I remember right, wasn't the older Nijima sister investigating it? Yes, I can pry and ask about it. But she'll just tell me to mind my own business and get angry with me. If you can't ask her, wanna just extract that data? Does she have a personal laptop or something? Don't tell me. I can lend you a storage device with my special gimmick on it. Just stick this baby in and it'll clone the internal hard drive. It'll even bypass the OS password. You'll have to plug it directly into her laptop, though. Can you do it? Sis does bring her laptop home sometimes. But I'm not comfortable going that far. Ooh, is Futaba gonna do something amazing again? Are you scared of seeing how your sister truly feels? No! Of course not. Fine, I'll do it. What? I was in a tabloid magazine? But I gave a gag order in regard to Mr. Kamashita's case. Please, wait! Please give me some time! I will find evidence on the Phantom Thieves for sure. I couldn't have made it this far had it not been for your assistance, sir. So, please, please let me. Uh. 
No! No! God damn it! Summer's over already. Went by too fast. Still, another six months ahead of you. Man, we. The rankings are insane. If you look away for a single moment, the order changes completely. It's hard to decide who to actually go after. They're flooding in. We can choose anyone we want. We should wait for now, though. It will surely cool off soon. She is as at home. She may not come back at all tonight. All right. It's, I'm counting on you. I suppose I'll do it. Anyone to hit up? No. Old man, I want to make some curry. <laughs> I want to make curry. Curry. This is coffee and curry. Well. So then we're gonna try brewing a cup of coffee from step one. Just listen to what I tell you. <clears throat> These beans are are Colombian, a medium fine city roast. Oh, and don't let the water boil too much. You're gonna be fine. I'll be here the whole time. Yeah. Not bad though, I guess anyone can do something as simple as just brewing it. Making a blend on the other hand is a different story. Mixing beans at random won't do you any good. That's because the acidity and the flavor profile all depend on the bean ratio. Pretty deep, huh? Tell me more. I knew it. Somebody- Oh, somebody's enthusiastic. If you're really that interested, feel free to try out whatever combination you might. Oh, but hands off the expensive beans, got it? Except it's the curry. Yes! There's something special about it. The truth is a scientific genius actually came up with the perfect spice combo to complement my coffee. Something about the quantification of taste. There is no formula for flavor, but it is pretty damn good. Anyhow, we don't make compromises when it comes to food service. Our stuff's gotta wow the customers. This is a tiny shop after all. Self-satisfaction is the only thing that keeps me going. You again. <sighs> Haven't I told you already? I don't have the money. Look at this place. You see many customers in here? Oh, no need to hide it, Sakura-san. You might have said plenty from your time working in the government. Aren't you taking care of that employee right there too, for nothing more than charity? I wish you showed me the same kindness you show others. <sighs> if you're not planning on buying anything, can you please leave? I'm expecting a phone call, so I don't have time to chat with you. I don't mind if you take the car in front of me. I can talk to your little friend here in the meantime. So, should we keep talking until your call comes in, or would that be too inconvenient for you? Well, looks like Sir Judas in trouble. What should I do? Eh. Call his phone? No. Oh, there's the social services call I was waiting for. They come round pretty often to make sure this guy's not getting in any trouble. Want me to introduce to you? Oh, that's right. I have some business. I need to take care of myself. I'll come back later. Jeez. Does he really have nothing better to do? I guess I should explain what's going on. He might try and drop by when I'm not around. <laughs> that man is an old acquaintance of mine who's short on cash right now. Looks pretty friendly. Yeah, don't let him fool you. It's all an act. I have to say though, I'm surprised you were quick-witted enough to pull that stuff off. You really saved me back there, thanks. Yay! We're moving up! Yes! Alright. But how much though? You can make curry on days when there are ingredients for curry in the refrigerator at Leblon. You will be unable to make curry during the day and after school when the cafe is open. Try cooking at night when the stove is free. Still, why do you poke around into other people's trouble? It's way easier to ignore them. I guess that's just the kind of person you are though, huh? Is that time already? I'd report him to the cops if he wasn't related to her. Never mind that. Anyway, that's it for today. Go study or something after you close up. Hey! <clears throat> Can we bring it up now? No, we still need to work on it. I want to go to Mementos. This game is not letting me. Good morning. Did you get a tan? You seem different. 
Oh yes, thank you for coffee last time. It's a lovely cafe. I haven't relaxed that much in a while. You should come again. Thank you. That's so nice of you to say. Especially lately since it seems I'm hated by those who support the Fan of Thieves. Anyhow, it seems your school's in trouble. The media is reporting that the whole school was involved in that cover-up about the gym teacher. Those unfortunate students were made victims all because adults value their own conveniences. This is unforgivable, no matter the reason. Let me know if you need anything. I'll do my best so that case is wrapped up quickly. Hey! Not even bad. Fast forward! Who are you? Did you see that ad in the train? The media is going to come to our school. At least be a little interested in it. Cover up by faculty and principal of Shujin Academy, where the Phantom Thieves first appeared. It's been a huge deal already. I wonder what's going to happen to the principal now. Anyways, we made the right choice going after big targets. Everywhere I go, people are talking about us. Whoa! Uh, I'm sorry. Oh, no, I'm fine. That girl just now, don't you think she was fine? The Phantom Thieves are on fire right now, so I wonder if I got a chance if I asked her out? It sucks that I can't just say I'm actually a phantom thief to anybody. Did you do it too, Teach? The whole cover-up thing? This is the first time I'm hearing about it too. Even if the police ask you anything, you better not make irresponsible comments to them. Seriously, why does this keep happening? All my relatives are gonna call me again. Oh, perfect timing. I think you might have been told this already, but it's about the school trip. You know how the police have been coming to the school again because of that incident? So, a number of the senior faculty are going to be called in for questioning. And that day just happens to overlap with the school trip. Yes, I've been told so. Now this came up at the faculty meeting, but the plan is to have third years to act as our proxies. I'm so sorry to drop this on you, Nijima-san, but we'll be counting on you. What? You know, a lot of the second years this year happen to be unique you must have your hands full with the entrance exams but I'm sure you'll be fine with your grades don't worry there'll be a couple more people going besides you if that's the case very well really oh, thank goodness I'll go ahead and pass this news on then I guess that works out. Me after school. You guys see? Akachi show up in the rankings. Perhaps it's due to the negative comments he made about us. Seems that way. God, this is freaking amazing! I feel bad. Come on, you don't gotta pity a jerk like him. By the way, how's it going, Makoto? You get into your sister's data yet? I think she's been busy. She didn't come home at all yesterday. That's problematic. What are you gonna do? We can't do a damn thing till we get that. Don't rush me. I assure you, I can handle this. More importantly, everyone at school has been on edge since the tabloid article. court. I haven't seen it. Please be careful and, sta and not stand out, okay? You don't gotta tell me twice. Can it be after school so I can play around on mementos? Please! That's all I'm asking. Yes! Well, I got like three things to do. Hey. Yes! No! Anyways, 
I'll be it for today's episode. Like, comment, subscribe. Shiraka 6 TV and I'm joining out.